Hey, Vic. Um, I thought I'd record a video because there's a little more nuance to your question than I can easily answer with words. Um, so you said, let's see, you said distraction from purpose is about prioritization and resourcing and not about governance. I'm not sure I agree with that. Can you expand? Um, yeah, so like lead links are accountable for setting priorities for the circle. And the the way that that work gets done is dependent on how the role fillers interpret it. So a classic example is, um, let's say you have a project to do a survey or to like find out about some new offering. As a role filler, you could send an email to the mailing list that wouldn't cost you anything. Or you could hire McKenzie to do a million dollar study over two years. The amount of resourcing that you put into any project is not a matter of governance. It's a matter of prioritization or an operational concern of the circle. Um, so in that way, it's not about um, concerns around prioritization are not valid objections. Um, let's see. And then Marcus said, if as lead link, I want to clean up the circle a bit in the long term, for example, after editing the circle's purpose, uh, right there, you can't edit the circle's purpose. You have to go to the governance meeting of the super circle and integrate any objections from other roles in the super circle. Um, but supposing that you, the, supposing that the purpose changed through a governance meeting, um, then yeah, you can totally go in and you can say, do we need this role or can it be removed? And you, you might say like, yes, I think we should remove this role. And then the role filler of that role can certainly object and then you get to integrate. So um, will the objection be valid or not? Of course, you have to go through the usual, um, the usual questions. Um, and the role filler of the role probably has a lot of information about the, the needs of the role or the purpose of the role, the projects of the role. So I think that they're actually a really good person to give feedback um, or to bring up potential objections in the meeting. Um, and yeah, you also said, in any case, I have seen human egos getting in the way. No, this role work is important because I just want to do it totally. Yes, there's a lot of opportunity for, I don't know if you would call it role fusion necessarily, but definitely role and soul fusion. Um, and so as a facilitator, you got to really be on your game in that situation. Hope this helps.